Hey, good evening guys and gals. Brian Buckley Woods Man out to start a new week's adventure. Arrowhead artifact hunting. May 11th, 2020. It's my mom's birthday. I want to wish her a happy birthday. Happy birthday, mom. Love you. But the reason I got the camera on, I just poked it with my stick. I just saw this piece here, but man, it looks like a big preform. And it's complete. That's nice. Big old blade or preform. That's pretty cool. Probably about three, three and a half. So. All right. Now I'll get back with you. Find anything else? Thanks to all my subscribers, new and old. Appreciate y'all. Like, dislike, whichever you prefer. Appreciate it. Later. All right, I'm back. Got another tip sticking out. Looks like it might be another blade find a lot of blades here on this little ridge i think there's a cache of them here my dad found a lot probably 20 30 years ago but yeah let's see what we got here yep just a little little blade or preform and that's what we find right here on this ridge so that's cool all right that makes about five for me i found three last year blades off of this little ridge so blades are preforms probably were preforms i'd imagine so all right get back with you if i find anything else later hey i also forgot to wish uh everybody all the mothers out there a late happy mother's day i hope they had a awesome day a uh, special shout out to buckley woods lady happy mother's day to one of the best if not the best mother out there she puts up with all my crap too and all this field walking and my mom Happy Mother's Day. Love you both. But the reason I got the camera on, I got a blade here. Looks like not too long after the other one. Another little preform. It's all that same type of material. Just getting lucky that they're all whole. These last two are fairly thin. Good deal. That's six. Same type of material. All right. Get back with you later. This is crazy, but I think I got another one of those blades. Same type of material. Laying right there. I haven't even put the other ones away yet. Let's see what we got. Yes, sir. It's a nice one too. Thin. Sweet. A little blade preform. Awesome. Good deal. Yeah, I know that's a cache. <laughs> like I said, my dad found quite a few 20, 30 years ago. Got them all in a box, and now I've got, what, six, seven, seven or eight right in the same little area. So, all right, get back with you, find any more. Later. Yeah, I'm back. Right here in this tire track. Walking down this way. There's a footprint. All right there, 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 but they missed this one. They had a pan off to the left, they would have seen it. Let's see what we got here. Hopefully it's all there. I mean, I don't know how it survived. It went right in between the track. And it's all there. Heck yeah. Looky there paper thin maybe maybe like a kirk or some sort of bifurcate not sure that's pretty cool though that's a day maker first one after those four blades I found it had some notches in it Man, it's paper thin. A little twist to it. Sweet. Not laggy. Alright, I'll get back with you if I come across anything else. Hey, guys and gals, it's Brian Buckley Woods Man. It's uh, May 12th, 2020. Back at it again. I'm trying to find some cool artifacts. Walk for quite some time, just found some pottery, but looks like I might have a T 
tip peeking out right there. Might just be a faker. Kind of looks like it's worked. Probably all busted up being down in here. Yep, just a tip. Oh well. That's how the majority of them are down here. Alright, get back with you. I'll find anything. Cool. Later. Yeah, I'm back. Finally came up on a couple notches. Hopefully the tip's on it. Sticking straight down to the ground. Yes. It's all there. Sweet. Good deal. I needed that one. All right. Get back with you if I find anything else. Later. Going back. I mean, put my other one away, and I just came upon this big tip. Would have been killer. And then I got one. Those Madisons right there. Hopefully the tip's on it. No. Broke too. Yeah, gone. Oh well. No, I just found this big old blade. Laying face down. Put all the mud on it. So all four of those just in ten feet. So we'll walk this pretty slow. All right, get back with you later. Hey guys and gals, Brian Buckley with man. May 14th, 2020. That's pretty cool. I can hold my camera still. It's like an owl laying up here. I don't know if he's hurt or what's going on. Where's a baby one? That's pretty cool. close to him. Out. It's crazy. Is it a baby or doesn't look like it, but checking me out. I'm just sitting there in the field chilling. Can't say I've ever seen that before. I'd say he's hurt, maybe, I don't know. Oh well, I'll leave him alone. Yeah, farmer just planted this field, so he turned it all up again and got about, I don't know, half an inch, inch of rain on it, but no, I'm not seeing too much material I just got here. Hey buddy. Strange. It doesn't look like he's hurt. Something going on with it. Yeah, leave him alone. He might have the Rona. All right, guys and gals, going to do a wrap up of this week's hunt. Artifact arrowhead hunting. Uh, this is a big old, typical big pile of pottery that I found. This is uh, one of the larger chunks that I found. Pretty good size piece. I just thought this was cool. Quartz, quartz crystal. Pretty cool. And some pieces of old bone burn up. Lots of brokes. This would have been a nice thin type of tool or a blade. Broke. Some teeth on it. Mm, this little guy. 
Plank blades. Broke medicine. Tips. Madison has a impact fracture. It's pretty cool. Little fan. Some end scrapers. Do the edge work all the way around that one. In scraper out of that type of shirt that I found on that intrusive mound site. I found my gorget and pendant. See the classic lip on there. Good focus. Pretty nice. First one I found out of that material. Another little black one. Found this big blade out of that same type of leopard speckled shirt. Looks like it's dirty, but it's actually the material. See how the edge work all the way around it. And I got a point made out of the same type of material. It's pretty nice. Nice. I found this point here. I think it might be some sort of bifurcate. I thought it might have been a Kirk style, but I think so. It's real thin. A twist to it. This is the one I found right in the tire track. Real pretty. And these are my blades that I find on that one little hump in the field. Uh, this one, it was these three that I found last year, and they're all out of the same sort of material. All found within probably 20 or 50 feet of one another. And then these are the four that I found just the other day. All very similar, well, almost identical material. So I'd say that's a cache of blades or preforms, whatever they're using them for. They are all buried together. This is the real big one. I said it was probably three and a, three and a half, but it's probably more like four and a half, five inches long. Off with my measurements. It's a, large piece uh, but those are all the blades that I find found on that hump like I said my dad's probably got 20 or 30 that he found there years and years ago or 20 or 30 years ago several of them I don't know how many there were probably yeah probably 15 or 20 of them so but those were this week's finds. Hope everybody's staying healthy and well. Until next time, good luck out there and happy hunting.